welcome back to Good Day Stateline. We love a great event and we love it even more when there are cocktails involved. Uh, Olivia <laughs> and Kelly are here tonight. We're going to talk all about this year's Sippin' with Suffragists. Thanks so much for coming in. Thank you Thank for you. having us. So this is an event. How many years ago did it start? Do you know? Like it's been around for a roughly, little while. Roughly three years okay. now got together. Yeah. yeah. So mm -hmm. tell me a little bit before we get started about the event and the cocktails, just about, you know, what you guys do together at the Rockford Women's uh, Committee, <laughs> Suffrage Committee. For sure. We formed in uh, roughly 2019, okay. um, about 13 coalition groups um, from local organizations to form the committee. Uh, and what we ended up doing is um, creating a statue. It's located in um, near the YMCA mm -hmm. Log Lodge, 200 Y Boulevard. And it is a three-sided tower on top of a base of uh, foundational women is what we refer to them as. And all of these women in some way contributed to um, suffrage, fighting for suffrage, civil rights, or were leaders in their respective careers. And it looks so awesome. I actually walk over there all the time and I'm like, oh, oh I don't know everyone's good. Because whatever year somebody good. was here talking about building it and we just looked at the sketches and we yeah. just looked at, you know, the, we, oh, we had like a little diorama or something of like what it yeah, would look like. It was, a, it was a little figurine yeah. at that time. Yeah, and so like, I'm like, oh, it's right there and it's so welcoming, right? So even mm -hmm. if maybe you don't know what it is just from walking by or right. not familiar with it or even kids, like it's all bright colors mm -hmm. and it's, mm -hmm. it's so inviting to like go inspect and learn a little bit, right? Yeah, and there's <laughs> benches around so you can have a seat yeah. as well so I mean it's it's a really cool place yeah it's so <laughs> cool so that's kind of what started this right was raising money for that mm -hmm. Correct. Yes. yes so now we're still having a party because why not and we're gonna celebrate some other things that you probably need to raise money for so the women's um, or it's a sipping with suffrage event it's on Tuesday tell us a little bit about what you know why we're having it this year okay so this year we are having it I mean because we know that the sculpture in the plaza, it's already there, mm -hmm. but we are still wanting to get funds together because this this venture right here, it would be just to offer um, educational materials, okay. you know, to bring kids, to bring parents, to bring students out just so that they can learn about yeah. it. And it's also a part of the endowment. So we plan for this to be around for a really long time, mm -hmm. um, but we, we want to make sure that we can take care of it and deal with the upkeep of everything. Yeah. So this is what our Tip the Bartender event is Yes. Um, next Tuesday at the University Club. And who doesn't love like getting invited to an event filled with delicious cocktails on a Tuesday? Mm -hmm. You're mm -hmm. probably free. Oh, <laughs> so if you weren't already planning on uh, coming over to the University Club of Rockford, definitely put it on your calendar. It's at five o'clock and these are the three drinks that are gonna be there, right? Oh yeah. Right. Yeah. We didn't make these by the way. Someone else, someone's else made them. They're delicious looking. Uh, they're beautiful. Let's start with this one. This is the Whiskey Sour Fridgist. Pretty close. Can you get that yeah. one? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty close. It smells good. It's like a whiskey it sour. Did there always oranges in whiskey sour? I'm not sure. sure. It makes it look great though. <laughs> this is good. Mm. Oh, absolutely great. This is like a party. It sure. is. It is. Party in a cup. It's only, <laughs> it's only two hours Tuesday? Yeah, two hours uh, <laughs> for the event on Tuesday. So you well, definitely have enough time to try them all, especially because this one doesn't have alcohol in it, right? No, right. it's one, not. One, <laughs> one, one, one. <laughs> you know, right. switch off and on. All right, so this is another one. Where, how did you guys come up with these names? You know, we went back to um, a book that okay. had these. Um, okay, in them. fine. And they were just, you know, a play on all the suffrage um, women who, um, you know, fought over time. And so, yeah. how clever. All right, so this one, you do this one. You you say this one. Okay. It's the gin this one. This is the Ida B. All's well that well. ends well. That's good. That's a tough one to say. That is a tongue twister. It is. All right, let's cheers to this. This is like a, it's a gin and gin tonic. Fizz. Gin fizz. Oh, gin It's fizz. a gin fizz. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cheers. That's super refreshing. Oh, yes it is. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take another sip. <laughs> I was I like doing the same one. thing. Mm -hmm. That is good. Mm. Okay, I like them both. This one is the last one. This is for the non-alcoholic drinkers out there. Absolutely, and this is the Sojourna Truth Bomb. Which sounds actually like it's got a lot of alcohol in it. Yes, but it's not. There's no alcohol in this one at all. Right, when you hear Truth Bomb, you're like, Basically tea and raspberry. Oh, it's yeah. lemonade. Right? I'm gonna drop my lemon in there because I like lemon. Oh, this is oh, really yeah. good. I mean, they're all good. See, it's a good that, thing there's no I, alcohol I in this because I, like I shouldn't one. drink this whole thing. Like it's, you know what I mean? <laughs> I think I'm with you there. Yeah, it's this super one good. tastes like summer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does. 
We have all the seasons, really. Mm -hmm. Okay, so tip the bartender. 50-50 mm -hmm. raffle, raffle baskets. Jane Adams is gonna be there. Yeah, she is. she's she coming is. back. That's for a big event. deal. She's from the Don't 1920s, but she's making a special appearance she just is. for us. Well, that's for cool. Us. Uh -huh. That's cool. Jane Adams is originally from Rockford. Yes. Yes. Yep. Illinois, uh, famous activist and suffrage from her time. So I will tell you again. I know earlier in the show I was uh, condemning where I grew up in the suburbs. They were telling me Jane, Ad Jane Adams was from Chicago. I come to Rockford. I was like. Excuse me, I have been wrong my entire life. <laughs> you guys can use some of your funds to fix that. Yes, yes, we will. All right, so make sure you join these ladies uh, Tuesday at the University Club. More information, I'm sure, on Facebook, right? Everything. Absolutely, the event is on Facebook. Perfect. All right, we got a lot to do during this break. And a lot to drink. Thanks so much for coming in. Coming up next, uh, Throwback Thursday, back to school photos.